that's one of my favorite things in Jiu Jitsu. We are going to counter the De La Hiva and we're going to do it with a toe hold. Let's do it. So toe hold against De La Hiva. Simple, quick and easy. He's got a De La Hiva established, his foot is inside, he's even got some kind of control here. And usually I would need to break the De La Hiva, step to the side, whatever. But I'm gonna attack the foot right away. Like so, with a toe hold. What you get, all I need is a foot. And most of the times he will have some kind of foot control. Maybe on my knee, maybe on my hip, wherever. And I grab the foot. Wrap around. Push towards his butt and toe hold. Okay? So literally just grab it, pop, pop, pop. Some kind of control and then toe hold. Now look at the details. So I'll try to clasp his foot right here. Not on the toes themselves. They are bendy and maybe slippery. But here, right when I go over the edge. So that's the first knuckle of his pinky toe. And when I move over it, I feel that uh, kind of notch where my finger comes in. And same here on the big toe, tuck in. And I really want to hold it tight. I want to bend his foot a bit to make it weaker. And he feels that I hold the foot fairly tight. Mm -hmm. It's already difficult to free it. Now I want to use my second hand, Ippon Ken, with my, um, my index finger on his Achilles, around the ankle and on top of my wrist. Now I got the foot, now I want to slightly rotate it to the inside and then use wrist flexion in both wrists to overextend that part of the foot. It's possible to overextend straight over the foot as in an ankle lock, but it's much more effective to rotate the foot this way. Also, I do not try to rotate um, along the tibia, so it's not that kind of rotation, it's that kind of rolling motion, okay? I control here, the ankle, hold, roll, wrist flexion, and tap. And again, so easy, pap, whoop, I got it. Now I need to stop him from rolling away. So that's why, so when I'm here, he could just roll to the other side, his left, to his left, and even more. And he's free. That was awesome, great <laughs> escape. So, and to stop him from doing that, whap, I bring the foot close. Because now, even if he tries to rotate, I'm following, and I got the hook on his butt and now he cannot roll anymore. Mm. And I can just gently break his foot. Watch it again. So I'm here, grabbing, pull, close. And even if he tries to roll, doesn't matter, toe hold. Okay, let's see it once again. <laughs> pop, pop, boom. That's it. So that's the toe hold against the De La Hiva. I hope you like it, I sure do love it. It puts a lot of pressure and many times it will just finish the fight and you won. If you like it, drop a comment, ask any questions you like and see you next time.